The origin story of the movie A Hard Day's Night dates back to 1963 when the Beatles were rapidly rising to international stardom. At that time, their manager, Brian Epstein, recognized the potential for a successful feature film centered around the band. Epstein approached the screenwriter, Aloon Owen, known for his work capturing the spirit of working-class youth and tasked him with writing a script that would showcase the Beatles' personalities and appeal to their growing fan base. Owen spent time with the Beatles, observing their dynamic, capturing their witty banter and charm. He developed a screenplay that depicted a fictionalized 36-hour period in their lives of the band members, emphasizing their distinct personalities and the excitement and chaos surrounding their fame. The script incorporated elements of comedy, satire, and a fast-paced narrative, reflecting the youthful spirit of the time. To bring the project to life, Epstein secured funding from United Artists and Richard Lester was chosen as the director. Lester was known for his innovative and energetic style, making him an ideal choice to capture the vibrant energy of the Beatles on the screen. Principal photography for A Hard Day's Night took place over six weeks in the early 1964, with filming locations including London on the movie during the Beatles concert tour. The production featured a mix of scripted scenes and improvisation, allowing the band members to infuse their own personalities into the film. The movie was released in July 1964 and became an instant hit, both critically and commercially. It not only showcased the Beatles' music, but also provided a glimpse into their offstage lives, captivating fans and introducing the band to a wider audience. The success of A Hard Day's Night further solidified the Beatles' status as cultural icons and marked a milestone in the merging of music and cinema.